YouTube, welcome to my channel. I hope you can hear me over the the engine. My atrocious <laughs> um, So we're just off to, uh, well, we're stopping at Hamilton for uh, some food, obviously. Um, if you've watched any of my previous videos, you'll know I'm obsessed with food. And um, then we're heading up to Mulgai and we're stopping at a Premier Inn. Um, because the beds are amazing and then <laughs> then we're, we're well I'm swimming at the Scottish National Open Water on Saturday um, and then we've got some fun lined up for Sunday which you don't know about yet <laughs> so um, hold tight for that because it's his birthday next weekend so um, I've lined up a surprise birthday present well obviously it's a, it's a surprise because it's a birthday present but you get what I mean, it's 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 gonna be good. Um, and I think I'm very excited for it. So um, I will show you the food, obviously, and I'll check back in later. Um, it's 12th, no it's not, it's the 18th of August and um, it's open water day. Um, last night we just had a chill night and we um, just went for dinner and just chilled in the room, watched TV. TV. So um, I will probably vlog some of the open water today and then tomorrow is the excitement Are you excited? Yes, I'm excited. <laughs> so I will film that as well. Hi guys, so I've just finished the open water and uh, I survived. So uh, we're just going back for some dinner and then tomorrow is going to be an exciting day after the freezing cold waters of Loch Vanaka. Um, so that'll be fun. Hey YouTube, so we've just had a um, nice chill night again tonight. Um, so it's Saturday night and I swam the open water this morning. Um, and after I'd um, spoken to you guys last, uh, since then I'd actually received a message with um, a picture of the results because when we left the results weren't up yet so I received a picture of the results um, on the way home and discovered that I was um, Scottish National Open Water Champion for my age so um, I'm pretty delighted with that considering I was just um, wanting to get around it and worried that I wouldn't finish it um, because I've only swam 2k in five weeks so um, but I've done a lot of gym work so I think my fitness must still be there um, so I'm quite excited about that um, so I just thought I'd tell you guys that uh, that's what's happened and then tomorrow we're gonna go to Go Ape we go, we're at Go Ape for 11 tomorrow and then on the way back home we're gonna stop off at Stirling Uni which is in case you haven't watched many of my previous videos, that's where I'll be starting uni in September. So I'm going to take my boyfriend, show him around where I'm going to be. And um, I'm excited for that because Stolen Uni is the most beautiful place. Like oh, I've dreamed of that uni since I was 12. So um, I'm excited to go around there um, and go, hopefully go to the best milkshake bar I've ever been to that place honestly oh if you're ever in Stirling it's near the train station actually it's called Flip and Shake and it's near um, Nando's and the cinema and it's in that area so definitely go there because it is amazing but you wouldn't know it was there unless you were looking for it 
and someone told me about it and now that I'm telling you guys and you guys can go and visit because it's amazing and tag me in any pictures if you do go um, either on Twitter at Sophie Louise Fit or on Instagram at Dots to Swim um, so tag me in any of them because that place whew, those milkshakes are good honestly people watching this who know me will be just laughing that I'm mentioning this milkshake bar because that's all I talk about about Sterling like uh, oh Honestly. So I'm gonna leave you guys while I go to bed and dream of milkshakes now. And uh, <laughs> I'll check back in later. Bye. Hi guys, so we just completed the Go Ape treetop climb. And I have a certificate of awesomeness to people who don't know that I'm awesome. I did too. Yeah, you got one as well, but it's all about me, okay? Um, <laughs> So, um, we, little story behind why we were at Go Ape, if I haven't already said it already, I can't remember. Um, so it was, it, well, it's Luke's birthday on Saturday, so as a birthday present I got him a Gymshark t-shirt and... Which I'm ripping now. And uh, Go Ape treetop ad adventure. So we went today, a little bit windswept, uh, better weather than yesterday. And I left little clues, well I didn't leave little clues, I gave you them, yeah. but I gave little clues. Um, Which weren't very helpful by the way. They were so, they were good. <laughs> Don't look at me like that. He's criticising my clues. Well, uh, I left clues and then eventually couldn't guess it, so... You, to be fair, you were close with Blair Drummond. Yeah, I know. One day we'll do that. That's on our list. So um, now we're going to go stop at a cafe, get some cake, cake, and <laughs> and then we're going to head to Sterling and I'm going to show Luke around the campus, which I now call home. Well, we'll call home. So I will insert the GoPro footage from the treetop climb now and I will see you guys when I'm at Sterling. Welcome to a stereotypical. Hey, up you do! Oh, for God's sake! Welcome to a stereotypical st Scottish weather. Don't put that in the vlog. What? Are you being a numpty? Nah, I'm putting that in. Oh right, hi. <laughs> so uh, we're at Stirling now, 
and given the grand tour. Yeah. Um, so we parked outside HH H. Donnelly. So we just walked to Path Foot. Yeah. And this is the main, well, it used to be the original lecture building. Um, so it's, um, this one was built and then they built the extra one on top because yeah. they had like too many lectures going on. So this lecture building's 50 year old, if I'm right. Um, nerd. Who are you calling a nerd? <laughs> and um, this has like quite a lot of art through it, like through the main halls. I don't know if we'll be able to get in, to be honest, but. We've just come out of Path Foot and we are looking at the pool and the gym's just behind it and then there's Astros and the track and stuff behind that. Um, so we're just heading that way in that general direction and where did you go? Yeah. <laughs> um, so I'm just going to have a look, well I've already seen the pool but I'm going to go show you the pool. But is rooming in my vlog <laughs> and then I'm gonna see uh, what the current status of the gym is because they're building a new uh, they're updating the, the gym and the fitness we'll walk up to the zebra crossing they're updating the gym around here so uh, I'm gonna see what's happening with the sports center at the moment um, it's currently under construction pool and we've had a look around the fields and stuff well showing you around the fields yeah. and stuff um, and uh, Sterling's got quite a large array of general sporting facilities just because it's um oh well there's a sign Scotland's University of Sporting oh, Excellence it's not gonna focus the difference it's not gonna focus <laughs> So we're going to take the lock walk up to the atrium. I'm just telling you stuff and you don't have a clue where we are. So, um, so this is the lock walk where hopefully you'll see a, a picture of me graduating here in like four years. Yeah. So um, sure it's obviously a stunning setting. You can't see it from the camera, but there's a big hill up there called Dumyat. Oh, you can kind of see it there. That one there. Hello. So um, there's a running joke in the family that because uh, there's a Dumyat race, and there's a running joke in the family that if I if I got into Sterling, then either my dad or Luke would have to run the race. Yeah. You're gonna run it? No, I'm not. <laughs> I can't swear on it. Can I? No. And my friends. <laughs> so um we will climb it though. We'll walk it slowly with yeah. with snacks. With no <laughs> no sense of urgency. Loads and loads of snacks. Yeah. <laughs> so um one day I'm gonna climb that big hill and I'll probably take the camera with me. So um I mean if you sit on the channel for long enough, I mean I'm sure you'll see a a video at some point yeah. of me climbing that big, big, big mountain. Okay, so here's the accommodation blocks and there's the bridge that goes across the atrium. Okay, so in that, the one to the right, that one there, the McRobert Art Centre, they have um, a cinema and a stage 
for like performing arts and stuff like that and they have like shows and they show um, films that are on at the moment and stuff like that and then if you go in the left hand door it takes you into the atrium which I'm hoping is going to be open today praying oh you can see the yeah. monument I'm going to speak very quietly just because that's the library in case you could not guess I'm squeaking on these floors the library <laughs> the library That's just a quiet, like, zone. Yeah. And then that's a food bit. The bank. The bookshop. The union shop. Okay, so this is the main lecture theatre. Is that the right door? Yep. And it's where, like, all of the more sciencey, um, my Spanish lecture will be in here this year and it's actually shaped like a DNA and um, because it's home to like the science department mainly and it's shaped like DNA. I can't find a map anywhere. If I find a map I'll insert it. And then these here are like little study pods where you can like study like beneath the stars and stuff. But that's not all that goes on in there. Alright, calm down. Revision. It looks like the DNA. Yeah. It's clever. We've just left the atrium and, and the, the Cottrell building. That's what the DNA one is. Yeah. And um, we're just crossing the bridge back over to the accommodation side. Um, over the lock. Which I'm never going to get tired of this view. Never. You know, um, the microbiologists use that lock for like growing stuff. Yeah, yeah, like they like test the algae and like create algae and stuff. Or the marine biologists or whatever it is. Yeah. And then there's normally like duck and ducks and swans and stuff in it. So. Thanks for watching um, the video. So we're just. Uh, I'm going to head home now and I will edit this video and um, so that's us pretty much done from this weekend. So um, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the quick tour of my new home and um, like, subscribe, do all that stuff, uh, leave my social media um, in the description box below. Um, and have a great day.